No judge, no jury. Two Bay Area men were fed up with crime in their neighborhood. Tonight, they're the ones facing charges after a case of vigilante justice went horribly wrong. KPI X 5s Joe Vasquez is live in Santa Rosa with the story. Joe? Liz, Santa Rosa police say two men were out here protecting their neighborhood because there had been some recent crimes. But then they attacked, according to police, an innocent newspaper delivery man yesterday morning. Before he know, they start beating the car with the pipes, and all he's trying to do is just avoid them and run away. Rafi Quinto is a friend of the newspaper delivery man, Jimmy Tronconis. He says Jimmy, who also works here at this pizza restaurant, is too scared to talk on TV. He says he was driving this gray van, delivering papers yesterday morning when two men came out of nowhere and started cursing, then attacked. Jimmy put it in reverse and started to peel away, but then he crashed into one car and then another. His airbags deployed, so he bailed out of the van. He just started running for his life because he didn't know what was coming next. So these guys are coming after him. They cut off him and uh, beat him up on the floor and they left him behind. Santa Rosa police say Rodeo Van Bladel and Matthew Mills will be charged with assault with a deadly weapon and conspiracy to commit a felony. As for Jimmy, he's still sore, but Rafi says he was back to work at one of his three jobs, supporting a wife and a baby, now with mechanical and medical bills piling up. I talked to one of the men who was arrested, Rodeo Van Bladel. We talked face to face. He didn't want to talk about it on camera, but he said he's completely innocent, that he was at home at the time. He doesn't understand why police arrested him. But then the woman who was standing next to him holding a baby said she also wanted to make something clear that there have been some crimes out here and that people in a van wearing masks have been driving around and it has had everybody afraid. Reporting live in Santa Rosa, Joe Vasquez, KPIX 5. The police check the victim out. They say there's no indication he's connected to any of the recent crimes in the neighborhood.